Hey everyone, it's Ethan Ormiss back again for another video today. And welcome back to the channel, guys. We're here again for yet another video and a video I haven't done in quite some time. Uh, but we're going to be unboxing a record, a vinyl, of course. Today we're going to be unboxing um, Lil Uzi Vert's The Pink Tape, or Pink Tape, which I'm pretty excited about overall. Um, I did enjoy this album. I haven't revisited it, revisited it a whole lot. I bought this probably a month and a half ago or so, I would say. Um, I don't revisit a lot of the songs on it, but I do um, quite enjoy some of the songs, which I'll talk about in a minute. But yeah, overall, it looks really nice. Of course, I really like the album cover. I think it looks really, really sweet. And the back of the vinyl looks really cool as well with the track list there. So that looks really dope as well. But let's rip this open. It does say here, uh, on the sticker outside that it's a uh, limited edition marble pink vinyl. I've looked at it online. It looks really cool. So I don't know for sure if it's is that one or not, but also I bought this for $65. So, uh, or 67, sorry. So not too bad, pretty standard for the record store I got this from. So that's overall not too bad, but let's open this up. Let's take a look at it. This might be my prettiest vinyl in my collection. Um, now, so this will be really cool, but well, yeah, looks really nice. Um, oh, I was gonna say we'll open it up, but no, it's actually just one sleeve with two record sleeves um, on the inside. So there we go. That looks pretty cool. <laughs> the artwork, there's two sleeves here. Uh, so that's really cool. It has the track list uh, on all of them as well. Uh, <laughs> this one is really oozy, I feel. That could have been a fire album cover too, I think. But uh, yeah, you know what? Let's pull out the records. Let's see what it looks like. Because yeah, oh, these are so pretty. <laughs> That's absolutely awesome. That looks wonderful. That looks really, really great. That's sweet. That's really, really pretty. That's very nice. It's more of like a purple than a pink, I would say. But that's a really, really nice color. So that's really awesome. Glad I ended up picking this up. I am intrigued to see how much I will be listening to it. Pink is my favorite color, which is probably a little reason as to why I enjoy this album, just because I'm biased. But overall, let's talk about some of the songs on this album. So how does this track list even go? Let me find, where is the start of this? Oh, uh, is this the start of it? I don't even remember. Is that the start of it? Yes, it is. Okay, so uh, I guess we'll start it off with, you know what, let's pull the vinyl or the actual vinyl out a little bit you guys can look at it some more so uh flooded the face suicide doors a uh, crush em, amped x2 died and came back spin again overall i like flooded the face suicide doors is probably my favorite song from the album um a is pretty good as well x2 is pretty good let me actually pull this out for you so you guys can get a better look at it that looks really sweet that looks really really nice that's awesome I am very glad I ended up buying this because <laughs> it looks really, really nice. Uh, one of Mel's favorite songs over the past like a year and a half or so, I guess, uh, has been Just Wanna Rock, so she's very happy about that. She loves that song. Uh, Nakamura is one of my favorite songs on this album as well. Uzi, of course, a WWE guy. Uh, CS, uh, Werewolf, Pluto to Mars, Patience, those four are all really good. I really like those. Zoom is pretty awesome. And I don't even know if, of course, and Sharday were on the album. I can't remember if they were, but either way, I'm very happy I ended up picking this up. And it's it's a really nice vinyl. It looks awesome. Uh, oh, it includes all three of the bonus tracks. So I'm not sure if that was on the original version of the vinyl, or of the album. I don't think so. So I wonder if it was a deluxe. I honestly don't know. I feel like I know Zoom, though. I feel like I did listen to them. That's a good question. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to revisit that. But overall, I am happy with this. I'm very, very happy with this. The vinyls look absolutely incredible, of course. I love this album cover. It's a pretty good album overall. So with that being said, thank you guys all so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts on the Lil Uzi Birds, the pink tape. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.